Hi guys, it's Joe here. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I want to address the topic of TACNAC. TACNAC is a common phenomenon that is contributing to premature aging and sagging of the neck. This is caused by us constantly looking down at our phones, at our devices, at our computers, etc. So in this video, I've come up with four ways to help treat and prevent TACNAC at home. If you would like to learn how, please keep watching. So the first way to help treat and prevent tech neck is to do daily stretches and exercises. I like to spend a few minutes a day doing these stretches in the shower. The warmth of the shower really helps to warm up the muscles, but you can do them anytime while you're sitting at your desk. If you have a little bit of a break during the day, you really don't have to spend much time on this, but just be mindful that when you have spent a long time looking down at your computer, you may want to just take a few minutes to stretch your neck. The reason you want to be stretching your neck is because when you spend hours looking down at a computer or a device, you are shortening these muscles up front in the neck. This is the platysma muscle and it supports the entire face and head. So it is bearing a lot of weight pretty much all day, every day. This is why you want to be doing daily stretches and exercises to help strengthen and tone the platysma muscle. Keeping this muscles strong and elongated is what's going to help prevent and treat tech neck. Okay, so for this stretch, you're going to want to tilt your head back as far as you can. Close your eyes, take a deep breath. You should feel the stretch right in the front of your neck here. Take a few seconds and come back. And then you are going to repeat that again. Again, you should feel the stretch right in the front here in the muscles. Get, feel those muscles getting elongated and just hold it there. Breathe and come back. So the next exercise I'm gonna show you, I like to call Howl at the Moon. It's a little bit silly, but it is kind of exactly what it sounds like. You're basically going to do the same thing you did before, but you're gonna howl at the moon like a wolf. Tilt your head back, and you're going to start howling at the moon, kind of like you're a wolf. And you just repeat that for a few seconds. You should again feel the stretch in the front of your neck like before, but this time you will also feel it on the sides here and under around the jawline as well. So this is going to help tighten the jawline. And then come back and you're done. So the second way to help treat and prevent tech neck is to use either a separate neck cream or just to make sure that you are taking your products down to the neck and chest. A neck cream is going to work on the skin. So we already did the exercises to help strengthen the muscles, but a neck cream or active ingredients are going to work on the skin to help keep the skin nice and tight and firm. If you are over 40, I do recommend using a separate neck cream. And this is one that I really love. It is the Remodeling Profile Cream from Cell Shock. Just gonna scoop some of this out. So when applying your neck products, you want to make sure that you use kind of soft upward movements to help really smooth the wrinkles. The Perfect Profile Neck Cream is a really active formula, so it's going to bring a little bit of circulation to this area and help firm and tighten the skin. This cream has a really silky texture. It is pretty active, so it's going to tingle a little bit when you apply it. It has kind of a cooling sensation. And this is just to help bring a little blood flow and circulation to this area, which normally gets neglected. So another way to help treat and prevent tech neck is with massage. So I'm gonna be showing some massage techniques that you can do. Um, you can do this a few times a week when applying your moisturizer or your neck cream. Okay, so for the first part of this massage, you're going to want to just massage upwards on the side of the neck. 
starting at the bottom and moving up towards the back of the ear. This is going to help smooth any lines and wrinkles, help to bring blood flow and circulation into this area, as well as release any tension. repeat this on the other side as well and do this a few times and then you are going to take both hands up in the front avoiding the esophagus you're going to go up and end at the chin and you want to repeat this a few times and then end up near the jaw and near the ear and for this massage you're going to scissor the neck and you're going to start almost as if you're choking yourself and then kind of pull things back, almost like you're ironing out those horizontal wrinkles. And repeat this a few times. And you're going to end in the back near the dip, which is called the occipital ridge. And that's also where a lot of tension is held. So you're going to release that and finish. Another way to prevent and treat tech neck is with a weekly mask. This is the exquisite renewing mask that's specifically designed for the neck and decollete area. It contains collagen, peptides, and hyaluronic acid to help address sagging and wrinkles. I recommend doing this treatment at least once a week. Okay, so once you have this mask on, you want to go ahead and leave it on for five to 10 minutes, smooth away any wrinkles, and then just kind of let it sit for a few minutes. So as you can see, the shape of this mask is really unique. It's a patent shape that you can't really get anywhere else, and it really covers the neck and the decollete area beautifully. It is made of a special biocellulose, which adheres to the skin and really helps the ingredients to penetrate a lot deeper while also hydrating and firming the skin. Okay, so these are the four ways of helping to treat and prevent tech neck. As technology advances, we might as well adopt these habits so that we can help prevent tech neck in the long term. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it and found it helpful. Please make sure to give it a thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you soon. Bye.